We're more than willing to help and then try to assess what the problem is. Turning on your faucet only to have brown water coming out. People who live in Claremore say it's been happening on and off for weeks now. And Two Works For You reporter Micah Hatfield went right to city officials to get some answers. The city is increasing the size of its water plant to double the amount of water available to people in Claremore. City officials say the installation of the plant and your average water line breaks are to blame for the discolored water. As we're transitioning from old pumps to new pumps, uh, there's going to be some of that residual pressure that comes and breaks loose some of the sediment that's built up over the years. Assistant City Manager Jonah Humes says the city's infrastructure is old. As it stands now, the city of Claremore collectively uses between four and five million gallons of water every day. The new water plant will allow for eight million gallons a day. So we anticipate that the new water plant will produce, you know, eight million or up to 2040 as uh, we project 3% growth. A short term inconvenience for a long term benefit. It's not appetizing, no one wants to drink that and we understand that from the city standpoint, which is why we are requesting and continue to request, you know, if you have an issue, contact the city. The water plant is supposed to be operational in about a month. Hume says they don't expect more yellow or brown water because of the installation of the plant between now and the time it opens. But if you do experience discolored water, contact the city. In Claremore, Micah Hatfield, Two Works For You.